Welcome back to Deus Ex Mankind Divided. We're on the top floor of the underground Diwali Casino, looking for the Calibrator for Kohler. And, well, for myself as well. And hopefully gonna help out Kohler in the meantime, by uh, getting this number two Diwali thug off their back, Otar. Just got into this room and took out these four people. They're just sleeping. Whoa, what? My vision's all blurry. Did I accidentally drink alcohol? Uh, Ivan, the gas code is still 1368. What part of change all the passwords didn't you fucking understand? Yeah, I've already hacked that. It's interesting the way the little fragments animate. Looks like they animated for a limited amount of time and then just kind of stopped. Well, some of them are kind of moving. Whoa. Okay. Strange. <laughs> of course, they just got a picture of pictures of models on the walls. That's what thugs do. I've got the password to this. Cool. Didn't even know that. It's always a surprise. Oh! That's the calibrator! Huh. That was easier than I thought. Alright, Kohler. I've got your neuroplasticity calibrator. That's great! I'm gonna pencil you in for that optimization procedure. Just as soon as I'm done with this house call. What house call? I got this other client, you know, doesn't like to be kept waiting. Neither do I, Kohler. Call me when you're ready. Okay, cool. Oh, that should give us a lot of XP. Hmm. So... Should I keep investigating this place? I mean, I have what I came here for. But we can always find more. Otar's computer. Security one, of course. Anomaly detected. Access granted. From Reddit. You don't like me, that's fine. I'm not concerned with your liking or disliking me. But there needs to be respect, Otar. Respect for our family and respect for our business. Baklav Kohler is business. So when I say to you that he's not to be touched, I fucking mean he's not to be touched. That's an order. If I find out Vano or any of your casino boys are hanging around giving him trouble, I'll put them in a fucking box. Clear? Whoa. So this is the Diwali number one, huh? Why is Otar going so strongly against leadership? Strange. Fano, I told you to lock the safe. There's money missing. This lack of professionalism will not be tolerated. Find out who took the money and make them pay. Oh, probably related to the people that were killed in that uh, room filled with gas. Code to mini storage. Oh, so there's a mini storage thing. Okay, I've got a code. From Vana, we collected from Caller last week, so what's the plan again? Just to fuck with him? Redditch has a hard on for this guy. I want to know why. Something's not right between them. Put the boots to him, rattle him a bit. Maybe he'll spill something. If not, fuck up his place. Let him know that that favor with Redditch doesn't mean he gets a free ride from me. 
I've sent some of the boys. Interesting. So Otar was doing it just to find out why the boss liked Kohler so much. What if they're trying to take power or something? Someone making a desperate play to win back the Oh! Based on the shape, I thought those were painkillers. Those were whiskey shots. That's what I drank before, too. Whoops. Is that the garbage shoot? Oh yeah, I went down the ladder to get to the other place. This this door I ignored. So I've already been all the way in there. This is the toilet. I'm really close to the front door, huh? Oh, I'm right over the front door. Try not to damage the tables. Over here. <sighs> Such a huge dirt that drank. <laughs> Oh, I love those noises. Alright, I don't think anybody's gonna find him there. I don't know. I don't even know why I did that. There's really not much of a point. In fact, there's only two of them in there. I might as well just shoot them both, huh? You should have done a better job, see the keep Over moving. <laughs> Oh, sorry. This is your last chance to walk away. Actually, do I want to mess with them? Cuz Otar's in there. What if I shoot Otar and trank him out? I mean, it probably won't hurt anything, right? Yeah, fuck him. Yeah, there are some civilians around here. They're freaked out, but it's okay. Don't worry. I swear they're gonna attack me for a second. Otar's revolver. Ooh, that's special. Oh man, I've got so much stuff on me. I'm gonna have to like dump some ammo, I think. This should do it. <laughs> I got your revolver. That thing is wow. That thing is tricked out. Custom made Magnum modified to use armor piercing rounds exclusively. This bad boy's been built to deal serious damage. Wonder how much I can sell it for. I feel bad for terrifying all these civilians. Actually, how many civilians are there? I swear I hear another one, but I don't know where they are. Anyway, there's supposed to be some storage thing. Wasn't very useful. Oh, there's a civilian.
Uh, yeah, this is where I went under the floorboards. Where else is there to go? Okay, I couldn't find anything else, so I think we're done in there. I want to check out the rest of these sewers. There's so much to here. So, obviously I've already been over there. Uh, this is that room filled with gas on my right. So I've been there, and I also went over this direction and came in from here. But I haven't explored here or here. Let's check out this area. Oh. Oh, maybe this is the storage room. Right, maybe it's not directly inside of the casino. It's just... I guess I control kind of all this area down here. That makes sense. Oh, frag lasers. So it looks like <laughs> it looks like if they trigger, they blow up too. So you have to... I can temporarily disable each one individually. That's kind of cool. Where... I prefer to use a security computer, though. Where could a security computer be? Well, you know, we have this new ability. Let's use it. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, it's just right there. So it's gonna come here and then here. Um. Mm. This way is quicker to go, but this way has spam. But then again, the spam's level four, so I think that would take too long to capture, probably, given how close everything is, how compact everything is. Let's fortify this and go here. Anomaly oh crap! Trace program initiated. I'm kind of worried when I come out of hacking, I'm going to hit one of these lasers. Maybe they're permanently disabled. I don't see a timer. Yeah. Just for my peace of mind. I don't know why I can hack this one. Because it's already off. Ah, I see another partially eaten burger. Nobody finishes their burgers in this universe. It's horrible. So if the firewall's here, then it's always going to get me if I go that way. So instead, let's go this way. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Nobody home. <laughs> Frying up rats. Mm -mm -mm. Lots of alcohol. Oh. Oh, civilians. Sorry, Naomi Mangritsky. Count your blessings that you are still useful to them. The establishment. Those who run the world. So this game has trained me to think that if I punch this back, it's going to open a door, given Miller's apartment. Damn. I guess one instance doesn't make a pattern. Ooh. <gasps> oh, I didn't even try to do that. I wanted to aim them better. That's how the game's played, right? Listen to how good those sounds are. I love that kind of like hollow, woody, plasticky or something sound. Nice. Where does that go? Oh, nowhere. 
That would explain why it's not on the map. Ah. Christ. <laughs> Boxes are so loud. They're very excitable. That's a level six. Uh, I think we'll be okay, though. Yeah. Access granted. I don't think I've ever seen a level six before. I don't know if I'm ever going to use Typhoon. I used it at the very beginning, of course, but I mean, I don't think I'm ever going to spend the points to get the augment again. I don't. I just don't see it as being that important for me. I'd rather just avoid combat altogether. People probably think I'm crazy. Large propane tank. I wonder if it's explosive. I mean, it should be. It just, the icon though shows it as being heavy, not necessarily explosive. Okay, so we've come through here. Where does this lead to? It looks like a dead end. See if there's anything down here. Nope. Actually, wait a second. There's this hole here. Where does this go? Try the other side. <laughs> okay. Challenge accepted. I I can't get up here. Oh, there we go. Wow. Ooh, multi tool. That was worth it. Okay, we've explored the sewers over here. Let's check out here. Also, right here, there's a breaker. Oh! Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. I thought I... huh. I thought I went this direction to get inside of the, uh, the casino, but I guess I didn't. Oh, that's right! No, no, I went into the room filled with gas and went up the thing. Hmm. Well, eh, I can't move that. I don't think there's any reason to go in there. Oh, look at this old door. Looks like it's from a whole different era. Oh, 
looking for a way to turn it off before I start to suffocate. Uh, I don't think we turn it off from down here. Oh, there's still gas up here. No. No, we're good up here. <laughs> and they give you a hypo stem just in case you got hurt. Thank you very much. Where am I coming out at? Monument Station? Oh. This is the metro. Oh. Yeah, just the metro. Huh. Wasn't expecting that. Oh, here we go. Why never taught? Who are you? No pocket secretary. Okay, so I think that's it for this place. Um, yeah, I think we fully explored these sewers. All right, let's head on out. Let's go ahead and sell some stuff, maybe buy some stuff, and check out a new store at the same time. So this is the Tech Noir, right pretty much at the center of town, next to the pedestrian bridge. And I just saw this and fell in love with it. Look at this. Oh, it's like a CPU or just a chip of some sort. All those pins and they move. I've always found those hundreds and hundreds of pins on a CPU. Actually, do they have hundreds? I'm pretty sure they do actually have hundreds at this point. Yeah, all, all the pins, tiny, tiny, little, incredibly fragile pins on CPUs, just gorgeous and really cool. And also terrifying, because yeah, if you bend those pins, uh, good luck. Hey, you, we got multi-tools for sale inside. Sold. Yeah, it seems like my kind of shop. The Megasharp M4220 is Tech Noir's choice. Once again, a winner, DJ St. Leon. Set your M4220 to the height of your choice with a height adjustability range of 5 centimeters. 5 centimeters? That's nothing. Full adjustability and better viewing angle than a shovel. Clap your hands four times to easily switch to 3D mode. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Nice gear you've got here. All high end. And you look like you know high end. Which biotech did your job? Not Isole. They don't come in black. You try this on all your customers? Just the ones made of carbon fiber. As one enthusiast to another, you can tell me. Gonna have to disappoint you. Maybe you can make it up to me. You look like the kind of man who might have access to breach software. That stuff's illegal. Come on, man, don't play around. You know why it's illegal. You know the world governments don't want us to find out their dirty secrets. But we will. And you can help us. Be part of the revolution. Anyway, just think about it. All the details are in the computer. Want to have a look? To sell? Or to buy? Sure. Great. Go ahead. Wait, what? This is fantastic. The cause is very, very grateful. Take this. A gift for a true freedom fighter. 
Huh? I, I, what? I'm so confused. I was under the impression I was just entering the computer to, you know, sell and buy stuff. I didn't know I was going to give them breach software right then and there. Also, what did they give me? They said take this and then just took me to the computer. Is this my gift? The ability to buy and sell? If so, can I get a refund? But I guess if it's helping the revolution, whatever part of the revolution they're part of, Samistat or who knows what, I suppose it's a good thing. Sold a bunch of stuff, and yeah, they have some pretty good stuff to buy here. So they do sell multi-tools, only 800 each, which is really not that bad. They also sell crafting parts, 100 for 500, which is extremely good. I mean, that's two-thirds of a multi-tool right there for just 500. So I definitely want that. Um, I haven't run out of multi-tools or anything yet, but I guess just in case, I'll buy one. Uh, and they also sell hacking software, and it's pretty dang cheap. Stopworm, that's probably the most valuable. Easiest to use. I think I'll buy all of that. Um, reveal, meh. I think that plus... Overclock, maybe? Overclock's nice. Yeah. You know, I've got 23,000 credits now. If I can find another person that sells Praxis kits, then I definitely want to buy them. I remember the first person I found that was in Adam's apartment complex sold a Praxis kit for 10,000. So if that's the going rate, then yeah, I could afford two Praxis kits, which would totally be worth it. Well, I think I'm pretty much done with the side quests I have at the moment, except for the golden ticket. I still need to give Edward the permit stuff. Still can't find them, though. But I can try to do that later and confront Seraph in my apartment. I've already done that. I think I just need to wait for them to get back to me. They were going to look into it, see if they could find any info. So, let's get back on the main mission. I want to meet Smiley at Ruzika Station. But I'm going to save that for the next episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, we're going to head to Ruzika Station.